unfortunately not the prettiest pictures greet us this morning. Our sky camera looking over the city of West Point right now. Some droplets of rain under very cloudy skies out there. The temperature, on the other hand, is rather comfortable. 55 degrees for our area right now. Humidity values at 100%. It is damp and it is dreary, unfortunately, for us this morning. If we take a look at our broader picture nationally, we do see our exiting system that brought us a lot of rain across the state of Mississippi yesterday. But the big picture is a major winter storm across the northern portions of America right now. And this, although it does not look rather impressive right now, will show you the watches and warnings that the National Weather Service has already put in place extending from Maine through New Mexico. We're talking about a couple thousand miles of winter precipitation. This neon green right here in Chicago, up to two feet of snow for most portions of that area. We won't have to contend with any wintry precipitation here, but we do have a severe weather setup taking place. Currently, a low pressure system over Arkansas will gradually work its way through our area today and tomorrow. We're talking about a brief period well, 12 hours or so of rainfall, heavy amounts of rain towards the south, even some severe thunderstorm potential in our area. This will track across through, bringing us gusty winds, even the potential for some hail. But the big story will be what is behind it. As this front pushes through, we'll be left with bitter winds. We're talking about a huge difference in temperatures. Our wind chill forecast does show where the front will be for 945 through the uh, western portions of the state. We're already seeing real field temperatures of 25 degrees in Tunica before the 10 o'clock hour. It feels rather pleasant in the Golden Triangle, however, still balmy at 61. But when we wake up on Wednesday morning, 8 degrees is what it's going to feel like in Tunica. And not much better, folks, in the Golden Triangle, 11 degrees. This is some bitterly cold air mass and the coldest this far this season. However, today, 67 degrees. We will keep the showers in our area and another warm night, 52 degrees. The rain chances will increase for our area during the overnight hours. And tomorrow with a high of 68 degrees, we will see our severe weather potential increase with winds out of the southeast at 10 to 20 miles an hour. As that front works its way through, we could see a possibility of some snow showers, especially towards the north for our Wednesday, a high temperature of 41 degrees. Sun will begin to return for our Thursday through the early portions of the weekend but still rather cold. It definitely will still feel like winter as we enter our first week of February. Look for low temperatures below the freezing mark and hopefully for a rebound with plenty of sun for your Saturday. Thanks for logging on. I'm meteorologist Ian Ginther.